This is my 1500 watt e-bike build. This is my e-bike build. This is the color I've gone, gone with, cherry red. Um, this is just a paint and prime. And then we've got clear coat. But this is the frame ready to be sanded fully back and then we'll chuck on a licks of paint. This is all the bike parts that's come off the frame. This has all been washed and degreased thoroughly, so that's all good. These are the wheels. All right, so the whole frame's been sanded. Now, I'm not gonna be too fancy with this part, but all these black accents are just gonna get a quick spray with black. All right, the cranks are all painted up, the handlebars painted up, and the front forks are painted up. First coat done of the... Alrighty, so priming has been done and it's ready, it's dried, so now it's time to paint the coats of cherry red. First coat on, ready to go. Still got plenty of the last two cans left, so lots more coats to go. All right, all ready. Clear coats on, just needs to set, and we'll take it off and see the reveal. It's now night time, and wow, that's clean. Just have to give it an assistance with the scissors, because it's kind of hard to get off doing this one-handed as well, so. That is clean. I just made a front plate and two mud guards for the bike. Cool morning in Darwin. Perfect weather to be working on the build. It's looking mint after the paint and clear coat. Off camera, I've installed the stem cap, the front handlebars, all of that, and the seat. Just the easy stuff to start with. Okay, so this is the bike assembled before the e-bike kit has gotten here. So, it's looking very clean. So the first package to arrive was a light bar for the e-bike build. Those are the mounts there that just clamp on. I'm um, pretty simple. This is me testing the modes. It's very, very bright and very good quality. There is a flash warning at the end. Um, because yep, there. <laughs> All right, guys, the bike's up. Ready to chuck on the 1500 watt kit. It is 48 volts. I've got a 28.8 milliamp battery, milliamp hour battery. Battery. <laughs> anyway, um. So, yeah, we'll just get stuck into the build. Bike tires all pumped up now. Up to six, on just under 60 psi. So before I put the actual wheel on, I'm going to put the disc rotor on that it comes with. It's similar design to what I already had on there, um, and my front doesn't match. So, but I'm going to leave it as it is because I do not care about the design. So, we'll put it on. In this image you can see the ESC is just about gone, the battery is already strapped on. But I didn't record a lot of this part since it was just bolting and tightening bolts and just strapping the battery on. Um, I did some soldering between the battery plugs and that's it. The rest was just mods and tidying up cable management and test riding it. On average the bike does 55 k's an hour and I can get it to 58. And with the top speed, it would be 62. I've got it. Now, what was the cost to build this bike? The bike was 250. The e-bike kit was 350. The battery was 560, and accessories were 200. That means the total is 1360.
To get the e-bike kit alone would be $910 since the kit's $350 and the battery's $560. That is a good price considering it's a 28 amp battery and it's a 1500 watt kit. You look lonely. I can fix that.